Hey everyone, welcome back to Ostriv, the uh, new series I started uh, an episode ago. I have uh, determined the name of the town. It's going to be Island View. Uh, why Island View? We have an island here. Yeah, it's just that simple. Yeah. And it is cooler than uh, potentially other, uh, other names. Now, we need to get eight more houses up before the fall, uh, you know, to get everybody uh, in, into houses. And that's going to take a minute. Uh, but we, we do have uh, houses under construction here. Uh, so what I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to go up to mid speed uh, just to get things uh, happening a little bit faster. And I'm going to look around here and take a look. Uh, I want to find where the stone deposits are. Uh, down here. Stone is down there. And then there's stone over on the other side of the river down there okay um where else no, that's probably it yeah i don't see any up there I don't see any around here. Ah, we've got uh, we've got stone over here too. Yeah. Okay. Um, right. And limestone down here. Okay. Well, that, uh, that tells me where the deposits are. Okay. Right. So, uh, how's this guy coming? And I'm just waiting for Thatch to arrive. And that's already arriving. Okay. And this is building... Uh, how close to the start of May will this come up? So if we're going to say, if, if this say takes to the middle of May, and that means each one is taking about a month, then uh, seven more would be seven months. It would just barely get that last one built when the before the snow flies. Although... Uh, the last couple are down here, so they're a little bit closer to everything. Um, all the uh, trees have been removed from this plot here, so there is that. Uh, so, yeah. Um, oh, this is a, a new thing that I, I quite like as well, that we have the message log, so we can uh, see messages that we missed, right? Uh, and that will be quite uh, quite useful. Now, I'm also pondering, uh, do I want to get a farm built uh, early? I think I probably do. So, I'm going to uh, start out with a farm building. Now, where do I want to do the farming? I think I want to do... Uh, now, it's a long way from the houses down here. But I think I want to put the farm, initial farm, over here. Now, this needs thatch and a whole bunch of other stuff. So, uh, it, it has to be built after the thatcher's hut and, uh, and everything, right? So, you know, there is that. Now, this is just about done mid-May. 
Yeah, okay, so we're putting up the the last bits now. Okay, that is a second family that has moved into a house. Uh, what are what are these guys growing? Um, what's this proposed relocation? Oh, okay. Uh, right. Okay, and we're building this. Uh... Ah, the well has come online. Right. Okay. Uh, and the next house is uh, getting constructed. Yeah, there's not much else you can do early on in uh, Ostriv other than building your your first uh, houses, and that's uh, that is uh, uh, important. Like, you, like you literally, that is what you have to do. So our mayor is Mr. Zubko. Ah, so the mayor is the first one to get a house. Okay. Well, that kind of makes sense when you think about it, doesn't it? Yeah, I think, I think it kind of does. Now, I'm also going to need, at some point, a trading post. Trading post. I think I want to put the trading post right here. Why there? Because it's close to the entry point where the wagons will come. Right, and it lines, and I can line it up with the grand uh, paved road and everything. Yeah, so I'm going to need that fairly quickly. I'm also going to need a town hall. Which uh I can put right here. Yeah. Why? Whoops. Because uh, the town hall lets me do stuff with the economy. So uh, I'm just going to put like the town hall here. I do like how uh, the footprint of the building doesn't uh, uh, doesn't prevent having the well there. So town hall, well, cart parking, and I'll put. Uh, a couple of, uh, well, I'll put a market stall in here as well. I can put a market stall right there. Now, in here, we're going to sell firewood. Uh, firewood, yeah. And we're going to go in here resource supply and we're going to allow yeah uh, right and we're going to hire options we're going to hire women we'll hire a lady okay who are you Roz Roz do Right. Oh, you're still in a tent. Okay. Right. Now, how's this coming along? Well, progress. Uh, mid June, we'll we'll have that finished. Yeah. Okay. And who are you? Ah, they do use the benches. Wild. 
Okay. Now, let's take a look in here. You can see the, the shape of the land here, right? Uh, yeah. So, uh, one thing I do kind of wish we had, uh, which we don't yet, is landscaping. Uh, where you could uh, specify a plot and say flatten it or slope it or whatever and then uh, the construction workers with uh, wagons and shovels and whatever will actually do that. Uh, that would be really cool. Uh, I suspect that uh, that we'll find that uh, the developers have thought of that and are probably planning to do that at some point. I don't know that for sure, uh, but it seems like uh, something, you know, it, it's something that the uh, 18th century uh, villagers would have been able to do and would have done, right? So there's no reason that it can't be something that could be done. It would take rather a lot of time and it would potentially require excavations from elsewhere. So I imagine that's why it hasn't been done yet, because uh, given the realism, uh, approximate realism that's going on with the uh, game here, uh, I would say they would end up actually implementing uh, dirt piles and everything else uh, for excavations and everything, right? And we got another one going up. Uh, yeah, we got... Uh, ah, we got our, our, our shop, uh, our market stall operator has moved in over here. Uh, I think I need another bench up here. Um, let's put another bench up here. How about over here? Yeah. Put another bench there. Right. So... Uh, this is waiting for... Oh, it's waiting for resources. Okay. So I'm ultimately going to put in uh, quite a few uh, houses uh, up here. And that will, uh, that will give a, a pretty decent initial workforce uh, for a lot of things. Uh, we need six more uh, houses built. Uh, and that, uh, I think, at the current construction pace, we'll be okay on that. Yeah, I think, I think that will be okay. You know, I do like the wear patterns creating paths in the grass and, and everything else. And if they stop walking on it, the grass comes back. I, I, that's been in Austria since I first started playing the game, like right from Alpha 2 or Alpha 1. Uh, yeah, way, way back. Um, I picked it up on Itch, I think, uh, initially. Uh, but it's just... Uh, it's just kind of, uh, kind of impressive, you know, all of this stuff. Uh, and at the time, one guy put it together, you know? That's... Uh, that that's uh, quite Im impressive. Um, we are growing cabbages and some. Okay, so we are growing uh, food variety. Yeah. Well, this is what you would have done back in the day if you had the space to grow stuff. You'd grow stuff. Because then you could keep some seeds from your previous year's uh, planting, your garden, and then grow new stuff. And, uh, yeah. Uh, this, ah, it's going to finish early July, by the look of it. 
Meanwhile, we're bringing uh, resources to the next uh, house. Actually, this should uh, these things should go a little bit faster as the uh, workers move uh, into houses too. I kind of like the soundtrack on Ostriff as well. It's one of the few where I don't turn off the background music uh, because it's so chill, you know? Relaxing, chill. Um, I'm going to put a bench here as well. I mean... It seems like seems sensible. Just build as many benches as you can, right? Uh, more benches is more better. More better, huh? Oh, this is a different uh, house. Right. And these guys are moving in. Yep. Yeah. Okay, how are the uh, carts doing? Eh, yeah. Right. Well. This is... This is uh, some sort of progress. So there's there's uh, five uh, families remaining in tents. And we'll be down to... Well, I'm going to end up... I'm pretty sure I'll have eight houses built before uh, winter. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll manage uh, nine. And it's just because I built this down here and I put the houses up here, right? Oh, I'm going to want a granary. Um, right, that'll be... No, it's going to be... Yeah, it's going to be here. Uh, I'm going to want a granary, say... Here? Yeah. So I can trade with the uh, the uh, residents, right? Um, right. Okay. So this one, uh, well, we're making progress on it, at least. Uh, oh, what I'm going to do is come down here. I'm going to fire that guy. Yeah. And I'm going to go in here and hire uh, another um, construction worker. Just... Uh, just to see if we can make things go a little bit faster, right? Then we can have more uh, more people hauling, right? And that, uh, and maybe more people building, and that might uh, get things going just a little bit faster. Yeah, and ultimately, I'll uh, I'll pave this just for looks. I'll pave the. Uh, and the square here, uh, and the, the main roads. But I'm not going to do that right away. I mean, it's just cosmetic now, I think. Uh, but uh, maybe it'll allow things to move uh, faster in the in future, like carts or something. Uh, that would be something. 
wonder if the developers are considering a potential um, education system where uh, uh, where uh, where the um, uh, not education a research system yeah where uh, new texts get discovered or something like that that yeah, we're uh, building this one okay now this one is going up I think I'm only going to get eight houses built before winter here Yeah, yeah, I think that's that's going to just uh, end up being eight houses. Well, something else that um, Alpha 5 has brought is spoilage, if I recall. Uh, so, uh, goods and stuff can spoil. What is this, bees? Uh-huh. Well, that's uh, one more family. Uh, so we're down to four in tents. Wait, I think I can drop this guy by one more and uh, go maximum builders. Um, yeah. Okay. Yes, uh, I think we only need one guy there for now. And, okay, we're starting to uh, construct. Yeah, we're on a hill here. You know, I kind of like, kind of like that, you know, the hill. It, uh, it is kind of cool. Now, this is a, a wider through fare than, or thoroughfare than I uh, really wanted to do there I think but it just seems somehow appropriate uh, this is uh, going up um, yeah how quick will that go up will it uh, will it finish in uh, in in good time or will it take uh, a little bit too long uh, right, I'm going to... I'm going to put a house here. And I'm going to bring that one up to here. And that one, and that one. Yeah, that's going to be a tenth house. And this one can go back to about here. Yeah. Okay. So if this one finishes in uh, August, looks like it will. Maybe. Um, yeah, maybe. Just need it to hurry up. Now, we have thatch, 1530. And we need uh, eight seventy. Uh, yeah, that's going to be close. Right. Um, Okay, uh, build another bench, because benches are cool. 
Yeah, benches are cool. And... Yeah, okay. Now, where are we bringing the resources to? Oh, this house is done. Okay. Now, there's three. Um, ah. We're bringing to this one. Okay. Yeah, so we got three tents left, and we're into September. This is... What's the... Not enough workers. Uh, not enough workers to chop trees. Yeah, we're not... We don't need to chop trees currently. Okay. right and this house is going up we have we have stuff being delivered okay that is good if we lose one family due to uh it'll be this this family if we lose one family because i don't have enough houses it's not going to be the end of the game. It'll just mean I planned poorly. Right? Uh, however, no. Right. If I put the clay pit up here, you know, like that, that's all I would have needed to do. Put the clay pit up there. Uh, yeah. How's the... Yeah. So the... I need to get the smithy and then the carpentry, I think. And then the farm. Yeah. So this guy is going up... Oh. Quite authoritatively quick here. Uh, yeah. Right. Now it's waiting for resources again, right? Yeah. Oh, somebody's uh, taking their tent down. Yeah. So it's clay, it's thatch, and it's wood. Okay. Right. So if this finishes before the end of September, then we've got a hope. And we got some hope that the... Uh, the last house will get up, get built, you know, in time. Uh, right. Okay. Right. Just needs to bring the thatch up, and then it should be. Yeah, the thatch is coming now. Okay. Now, in here, I've got... No, I've got in here... 1,030 thatch... Ooh, wow. This is... Yeah.
right okay down to two when we finish that in September so here we're down to 1030 and we need uh, eight, 870. Okay, that is, that is good. Right. So these two will go up and then we'll start working on some other stuff that is important. Right. Um, yeah. No, we're not going to allow that one for production. Okay. Why is that going down? Oh. Uh, right, okay, so um, this one is making progress. Okay, that's good. Yeah, these later houses are going up faster because the ones that are just doing the construction work, they're coming from the houses over here, uh, at least some of them, right? So... Uh, by the end of October, will we get all the houses built? That is a question. Well, uh, this... By the end of November, I think we will. Yeah, not quite by the end of October. Yeah, more benches. Put a bench here. Put a bench, yeah, get another bench. Put a bench here. Yeah, more benches is more better. Is it more better? I don't know if it's more better, but it's uh, giving people places to sit down kind of what you kind of what benches are for you know when you really think about it right uh, we invented these things where you can sit on them we call them benches so we can sit on them okay yeah this house will be finished mid-october now i think Bringing resources to the... Oh no, that's the thatch. Okay. Uh, it should They should start bringing resources to the next, uh, the next house over here, though. Yep, there they go. So the, they'll get be able to get started on here pretty quick. And then here, uh, we're just putting up the roof. We'll be good. We'll be down to one house needed. There we go. So now this just needs to finish. We'll have the nine houses. And that will be the first year minimum mission accomplished uh, but we will have to build the smithy and then the carpentry that needs 112 nails how many nails do we have left enough okay yeah here we go uh, yeah we got Play coming.
Yeah, carts are wearing out. I know the carts are wearing out. Uh, I need to build the houses first. I gather that the carts wear out based on travel distance. So, uh, yeah, that's another reason to build your stuff closer to the camp. Okay, what are we... Uh, just about have everything here. So, yeah. Okay, uh, mid-November should be should be good for uh, the last family moving into a house. And we won't have the the tent here. We'll just have the rest of this stuff down here. So, yay! Uh, right. I'm also gonna need warehouses in, uh, to store things, but. I'm not sure where I'm going to put that stuff yet. Okay. Um, right. Okay. That's the last clay. Okay, so the smithy needs 112 nails and clay. The carpentry... Oh, build the carpentry first. Yes, I know I need uh, a thatchery. Yep. Okay, and the last family is going to move into a house in November. So, I didn't do this in the most optimal way, uh, as is pretty obvious. Uh, it was not the most optimal, but uh, by the end of the first year, I will have all my, all my initial families in houses so it's definitely doable and bam uh, yeah okay so that is the the houses, and now we're building the carpentry, uh, which will uh, which will allow us to repair the carts, and then uh, and then the uh, smithy. And where did I stick the the thatchery? there I don't know that's a good place for it but I'll stick it there anyway uh, anyway uh, this is a good spot to put the cut uh, the critical first uh, first year stuff is complete uh, the farm is important but it's the the next thing I need need to get going but I uh, I need some other infrastructure first uh, I may end up building the trading post and uh, buying food in uh, anyway 
so I, I'm going to put the cut here, as I said. So uh, I'll mention that I have a Patreon. Uh, if, if for some reason you want to support the channel, the link will be in the description. Otherwise, well, you can ignore the link in the description. And all that said, see you back next time for the first winter. <laughs>